Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Selenix Crypto. I hope you're all doing great and welcome to this uh, new video on Jasmine. I uh, wanted to do a quick update on that today. It's been a while since I covered it and I do have a lot of, uh, well, quite a lot, uh, quite a lot of things to talk about, especially regarding the technicals as well. Um, technicals are quite interesting, actually, and um, I already did this video once, but the audio wasn't recording, which is a problem I have had uh, quite a lot of times over the last week, which is frustrating especially when you make like three, four videos and then you, you check the videos and then didn't record. But all right, so on, on the, regarding the technicals, there's quite a lot to talk about. We're actually at a, I would say a crucial level, even though I, I never really like saying that word, but, but it is a crucial level. Um, and, uh, and yeah, I, I do have some thoughts about the fundamentals as well regarding uh, Jasmine. So that's what we'll talk about. Uh, before we get into Jasmine specifically, though, if you want to receive daily trading signals from me, check out the links down in the description. Um, next week, I'm also publishing my own trading guide, which is bound to be, I think, very, very valuable. That comes included with the signal group. Uh, so then the price also goes up. So if you still want to join, join at a lower price um, and that price will remain the same if you have joined at that price, then check out the links and uh, it might be a good idea, good idea to join because we have been quite uh, profitable over the last month. But now onto Jasmine. So to start off with the fundamentals, I mean, with Jasmine, something you should know is that there's always um, that potential for bullish fundamentals because of its delisting from, from Binance, right? I think at this point of time, even though I'm not 100% content uh, or I'm not 100% happy with how they have been uh, handling their, their business, I think they should do more uh, with engagement with the world. And I think they should just in general do do more updates and more... Um, I don't know, more information for, for the general world and not only for the Japanese uh, audience. But apart from that, I do still think the most likely scenario is that, that they will be fully relisted. And um, and yeah, that that's that's always something that's looming, right? So if, if there's some sort of rumors about that, that would happen at any, any point of time and then we will rally, all right? But right now, if we take a look at, at Jasmine, it's more... Like we got, we, we actually got quite a lot of bullish momentum and actually a lot of volume as well. Volume right now is up 60% since yesterday, which just practically does not happen um, in, uh, in in normal weekend markets. But in the end, we just found resistance at 0 0.4 cents. And that's our main, uh, that was a very strong resistance. So it was expected that we would find some resistance there. But after that, we also got some bearish confirmation by dropping immediately below 0 0.39 cents. And, uh, and and now, I mean, it's still possible to actually get some sort of a rally from the current levels, all right? But it is going to be like the level we're at right now is really the last level from which that's possible. So uh, the thing we should do, and it's also possible, but I think it's only possible if Bitcoin gets some strong bullish momentum from where we are right now. Um, and we'll talk a little bit later about whether I, whether I expect that or not. But the only way in which we could, could do that is if Bitcoin gets some bullish momentum and, uh, and Jasmine can break above 0 0.0389. That's the main level to break. If, if from the current levels, which by the way is 0 0.37 cents, if we can get that, that bullish breakout, then that's a huge bullish confirmation. And I think there's actually enough momentum to go all the way up to these levels right here at around 0 0.42 and 0 0.43 cents. Do I think this is the most likely scenario though? Like I said, I think it's more likely in the next 24 hours to get more bearish momentum from Bitcoin. So no, I think it's more likely that sure we'll find some support here at 0 0.37 cents, but that will just find a break retest off of 0 0.38 or 0 0.00385. And that from there will drop down to this level right here at around 0 0.35. And that will consolidate in the regions right there. But that's my full take on Jasmine for now. So if you do have any questions, then let me know. But for now, thank you for watching. Take care and bye.